Hey guys, well, I got a little update for you in the dental department. The dentist was just here and we talked a little bit and he asked me how I'm doing and how I'm chewing. And I told him that Without my teeth, I basically use the back of my tongue against the roof of my mouth to chew. I, I can't eat a hot dog, burger, or pizza the regular way. I have to use a fork and knife and cut it into small, smaller pieces. And I said, I can't use dentures because I lost gum, t I lost all my gum tissue, and the doc and the dentist said, "You didn't lose all your gum tissue; only about ninety percent of your gum tissue. But it isn't the gum tissue that holds the denture in place. You know that you use denture paste or poly grip or any of those things." He said, "It's the bone, the bone," and he said. You lost some bone. I said, I did? I mean, gum tissue, I can understand because I remember when the denture plate used to cut into the gum tissue and I would be gum tissue in front of the tooth or dentures. And then they'd have to cut the gum tissue off to relieve of the pain and the pressure. So he says, no, you lost about 90% of your gum tissue, but it isn't the gum. I said, well, then how come if it isn't the gum tissue that holds the denture in place, then why won't the denture stay in place? Even with denture paste, that food particles get caught underneath and the hair comes right out. He had no answer. So, anyway, that's the update in this regard. Um, so, at least I know that I lost 90% of my gum tissue. Uh, and I thought I lost all of it. And uh, and he said it's not the gum tissue that holds it in place, it's the bone. Now, this is what he told me. Now, I'm not a dentist. I've never asked a dentist this because it never came up. It never had to. So, because it never had to come up, and I never occurred to me to think to come bring it up. So, this is the information that I'm given. So... I'm asking you guys uh, what you know about this. And uh, please let me know by putting it in the comment section down below. I greatly appreciate it because I'm always learning. I'm a never ending student of psychology, sociology, communication, and pretty much everything else. <laughs> you know. Because my uncle, my beloved uncle Warren, he said, the day you stop learning is the day you die. And if you don't go through a day, it's the second thing he said, was if you don't go, if you go through a day without learning one thing, at least one thing, no matter how insignificant it might be, then the day is wasted. So, I'm inviting all you guys, if you have any knowledge of this issue, to please put it in the comment section below and let me know so I can add to my knowledge. Okay. Thanks for watching. Thanks for listening. And I'll see you guys later. Take care, guys. See you soon. Bye.